ring on her left hand, but will now wear the old one on her right. Well, when it comes to men and women, it seems sometimes we're speaking different languages. Woman's Day is out with a new list of things your husband wants to tell you, but does it? CBS 2's Stacey Butler spoke with an expert to decipher what men really mean. Women run the emotional show. If what renowned psychologist and author Dr. Pat Allen says is true, then wives, it's time to listen to what your husbands wish they could tell you. Were you a respectful wife? I believe so. A small thank you makes a huge difference. Studies show happy couples compliment each other often. Saying thank you is easy, and it makes him feel significant. The one thing men want, they want you to smile, and they want you to appreciate. They're more likely to offer you concrete advice than a shoulder to cry on. When you come home from work and start complaining to your husband about your demanding boss, to him it sounds like you're asking for help, even if all you want is a sympathetic ear. If he tries to fix it, Dr. Pat Allen says, that's how he shows he cares. Just tell him clearly, you need to vent. It is a very hard time to be a man, because men need to do good to feel good. Women need to feel good to do good. If you want a chore done by a certain day, tell him that. All he's hearing is you want it done, not that you want it done based on a time you've set but haven't shared with him. Dr. Pat Allen says always be specific. And tell him directly what's bothering you. Men are perplexed by their mate's fluctuating moods, wondering why she won't just say what's making her so angry. Dr. Pat Allen says ditch the passive-aggressive behavior and try this out on your husband. You had every right to say that, think that, feel that, do that, but I'm not comfortable with that. I don't really want to experience this. What do you think about not doing that? And please don't ask him how you look in that dress. First of all, there's no right answer to a question like, do these pants make me look fat? If it's honesty you're after, be careful what you wish for. Stacy Butler, CBS 2 News. And one more thing. When it comes to the bedroom, the key word is compromise because men want to feel wanted. That's according to, uh, you know, Miss Allen there. But they just don't want to say so. <laughs> okay. Well, Jackie, I don't know what weather has to do with maybe moods, huh? <laughs> you're right. The moods. You know, pleasant weather, good mood. <laughs> I, right? thought at, I thought at the end there you're just adding your extra tips. but <laughs> Oh, no, see, that's why I, I preface Miss Allen. Dr. Allen says. <laughs> that's very good. Thank you, Pat. But you're right. Uh, maybe getting in the mood tonight because of this very nice weather. Uh, it, Definitely is good for cuddling when it gets a little bit cooler out there. We've got the fog that has rolled in, so that marine layer, you will see the clouds.